Hello YouTube and welcome to another Windows tutorial. So today we'll be talking about buckers, what they are used for and how to use them. So already let's get started. So actually buckers are just a program that allows us to reduce the size of an executable. That's the main purpose of buckers. And also they can be used by hackers or crackers in order to hide the readable code of a program. So I'll be using here as a demonstration a very famous packer called UPX. So you go to your browser and you type this address here upx.github.io and you download the latest version. So me, I'll be trying to pack a very famous file archiver called WinRAR. So I put it on the same directory where my packer resides. Okay. Then as you can see here, it's WinRAR. So I will open my command prompt and I will go to the directory where my packer resides. So as you can see here, if I just type dire, you see that I have WinRAR and UPX, my packer, that are in the same directory. So let's try to actually pack this program here, WinRAR. So I'll just type upx.x and I will just make as a switch minus O for output and I give the name of the output file. So I will just name it winrar slash packed. So I will distinguish between the packed and the original file. And here at the end I will mention the, our original file which is winrar.exec. Okay. And I will hit enter. So as you can see here, I have packet my original file so let's verify that as you can see here we have created a file called winral slash packet and if you take a look at the size you see here it's the original file was about 816 and the output was 376 so we have reduced it its size about uh, 46 percent as you can see in the output of my program here okay so the main purpose of a packed or a packer is actually to reduce the size of our binary file so now let's try to see if we can spot a packet file so in order to do that we use another program called PEID so that you can find it on the net. So if I fire up my program here, so I will give as entry point actually the file that I have packed. So I will go and I will choose this winrar.exec. Okay. So the first thing that you can notice here, this is the entry point of my packet program and here it's a very important section which called entry point section and you can see clearly it's UPX1 you can even click at this button here and see the different sections so this is section number one UPX0 then UPX1 then resources so we have three sections here okay So now let's try to make a comparison between that and our original file. So I will see now my original file, which is WinRAR. You will notice that we have a different entry point. And also at the bottom, we can see clearly that it was developed using Borland C++. And sections actually these are the original sections text, that text, that data, and other sections here. 
so this is our original file and the packed one actually have changed also the sections and we cannot see with which program it was developed so just keep in mind that uh, when you pack a program or executable file it changes its entry point and it changes also the entry point sections so it can be used by uh, hackers or programmers in order to protect against reverse engineering or even to make malware and so on programs so that was just a brief introduction to packers as always i hope it has been informative for you and i want to thank you for viewing bye bye